The stage is set and the tension is palpable. 90 minutes of what should be highly entertaining and absorbing football to come. And it would take a brave person indeed to predict the outcome. What an enticing prospect. Welcome to this first knockout round game here at the 2024 UEFA European Championship. My name is Derek Ray and sharing microphone duty with me as ever is Stuart Robson. And I'll tell you what, this promises to be a terrific game to commentate on. It's Portugal and they take on Serbia. Yeah, we're now at the business end of the tournament, Derek, and both of these teams deserve to be here. But which will have that extra bit of quality? It should be a terrific game. As you can see, that's a great bit of skill. He times this so sweetly. What a good goal that is. Get at the opposition. A 
There's the feed into the box. Aware of the threat, solving the problem. Kostic. Mitrovic. And still looking for space. to continue but now he's going to go back and hand out the yellow card Stuart well, he thought he was going to get away with that but quite rightly he's got a book in the short corner let's see what a good place to win it back and let's see what it leads to it's good referee. Well, patient passing could be the key to bringing themselves level. Mitrovic. Wasteful from Portugal. Since they have the ball, the referee playing advantage here. Well, here's the replay. He does well to find that bit of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure to finish it off. That's a good goal. The first half draws to a close. away once more and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half Bravo Beach. 
so they had attacking momentum, but not so. That's a good-looking ball. And a strong glove on the ball from the keeper. Valinia. Well, they get the ball once more. Too much here. Bruno Fernandes has it. And it's Ruben Diaz. Alinha. No good vision. Well read to ease the pressure. Milinkovic Savic. Just watch this again. A change of pace, a change of direction, and a decent finish. That's a very good goal. So there we have it. 2-1. Pepe. Holding on to what they have is the priority, apparently. Fernando Silva sliding it through. Nikolaj Milenkovic. Zipkovic. Chance to do damage. Can he put it away? And the keeper more than equal to the task. So a personnel change. Well, let's 
look at this again. To pick out this pass shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect. And Ronaldo finishes it with so much quality. Just look how much power he hits this with. It's a top-class goal. Well, it's a tale of four goals in this match now. 3-1 it is. Well, we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Now, let's see what they can do here. There's the feed into the box. Oh, a very fine header, but it wouldn't go in for him. Diogo Jota. Ronaldo. The fans are shouting, shoot! Let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. And I have to say, the finish from Ronaldo is just brilliant. He's such a good technician. It's a wonderful goal. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Strahinia Pavlovic. Babic. Tanic has it. Braovic. And Portugal regaining possession. Shots on. Kostic. Tadic has it. And return to Tadic. of the proceedings they haven't been at the best well let's see this again the vision to play this through ball is superb and the movement is good making for a comfortable finish it's a really great goal of their forward play was excellent they created so many chances and scored some really good goals but i don't think they'll be happy with their defending they made some poor mistakes and that will need to be rectified before the next round <laughs> 